My name is Nolan Edder, and I had a muffler shop called National Muffler Shop there on in, in here in Indianola. And uh, I decided to be kind of neat to make a man out of my exhaust. <coughs> These are pipes, exhaust pipes. This is a muffler with a two outlet and a one inlet. And uh, I made it, set it out in front of my shop, and then I made me a dog and <coughs> put a chain to it, to his hand and around his neck, and I was sitting there. And a lady come by and seen that, and she said, would you sell it? And I said, no, I don't want to sell it. I said, if you want one, I'll make you one. She said, no, I want the original. So uh, she said, I'll give you $100 for it. And I said, wow, wow. But I said, I got to have something sitting out in front of my shop. So I made another one. And she said, I'll paint it for you if you'll sell this to me for $100. And I said, well, okay. I mean, I, she said, I want the original. I said, no, I'm making that. She said, no, I don't. I don't want to. She said, I'll paint it. So she, I built another one and she painted it. I was satisfied with it. So she took this and now it ended up here. I didn't know for a long time. I had somebody that I, young people that I know and they said uh, they had a picture of it and I said uh, she said they, they said did you make this and I said yeah I made that well it's down in the museum and I said it can't be <laughs> <laughs> and they were telling me about and showed me pictures of it so I said I gotta go see that that's my <laughs> that's my original man I made <laughs> Even put his glasses on him. <laughs> Poor old man. <laughs> He's been around the circle for a while. <laughs> so that's this is what happened to him. He was he, he was down here. That's good. He needs a little painting up. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Painted. My brother-in-law painted him. Uh, he could spray paint. I didn't have a spray gun or anything. He sprayed it so. This has been sprayed on by my brother-in-law and uh, hand-painted that. And I built that little Dotson dog. She took it to, uh, they were having a museum deal in where she worked at, EMC Insurance. And uh, she took that dog up there and she won two different deals. What was it? She, she won I best. Won the first First place. First I prize was that. I got a plaque place. and a blue ribbon for it. His name's Barky. <laughs> <laughs> I, I still was going to ask him. you what happened to the dog. I now still, I know. I still <laughs> got him. <laughs> He's sitting on the front, our front porch. She's getting all. Put a note on him that he wants his master back when we're gone. I won't get rid of my dog. <laughs> No, no we, we're not asking you to, no. if it, rather than throw it away or... Oh, I ain't gonna throw it away. Everybody oh, I know, but maybe your kids or some of your family. Well, they would like to... to the day that uh, I have to get rid of him, I will definitely bring him down here. That'd be great. We'll hook a chain, we'll hook a chain to this guy. If the family wants to keep him, that's okay, but we like yeah. to have this stuff before it gets thrown away. Well, I'll never throw it away. Yeah, well... I made another one. I had an old barn on this place we bought after I sold a muffler shop. Uh, <coughs> I uh, took it home and I stored it in this old barn. Well, coons got in there and everything else in that barn and broke him up. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the life of him. 